Today on Orbital Mechanics and Astrodynamics Explained, we're going to be talking about a patched conics transfer. This transfer breaks the problem down into multiple two-body problems and uses a hyperbolic exit, an elliptic transfer, and a hyperbolic arrival. It also considers the spheres of influence, which are represented here in green. These are the areas around the celestial bodies where the gravitational pull is significantly stronger than that of other bodies. After calculating our phase angle, we can have the spacecraft leave the sphere of influence of Earth using a hyperbolic exit. Then, up here, using our elliptical transfer, we can watch as the spacecraft moves from that initial orbit around the Sun into the final orbit around the Sun. After the spacecraft has reached that final orbit, it'll perform a hyperbolic arrival and enter the sphere of influence of our new planet. We are able to load up a patch conics transfer in FreeFlyer, a powerful orbital dynamics software that's capable of doing the necessary calculations. Here we can see as the spacecraft leaves the sphere of influence of Earth on that hyperbolic trajectory. Then it will go into that elliptic transfer orbit around the Sun and eventually arrive on a hyperbolic arrival around Mars. Up here, we can also see where the delta Vs required for this transfer are calculated by FreeFlyer. Thank you for watching our Orbital Mechanics and Astrodynamics Explained series. Be sure to follow us on YouTube to learn more FreeFlyer and Flight Dynamics resources, and see the link in the description to download FreeFlyer today.